I went to Ecuador and I went to visit family. Without further ado, here's my haul. So for the first thing, the first thing I bought over there, I went to Otavalo, which is a, a little city, uh, like an, yeah, a little city in the outskirts of Quito, maybe like two or three hours away from the capital. And they're basically known for their artisan, um, jewelry and decor things that are handmade um and i bought this you can use it as a bracelet you can wrap it around like this use it as a necklace and it's basically coral coral real coral and i just found it so beautiful orange is one of my favorite colors so i loved it and i had to purchase it but i bought something else in otavalo actually if I'm not mistaken, I bought this plus another one that I already gave to my friend, my friend's daughter, and it's pink. But this one is a purple and it's a shawl. It's thin, it's beautiful, it's handmade, and um, they sell it over there like two for five dollars. And you can see like from the fringe here, it's really handmade, it's very delicate, you have to wash it by hand only in cold water so I bought those two this, this one and a pink one um, and the necklace in Otavalo then um, around the city um, I bought uh, more shawls I bought a, a pink one um, that is similar to this actually red one just picture it pink and I gave it to my one of my best friends and I got this one well actually my mommy got this this one for me she bought this one for me and it's a red with gold trimming isn't it gorgeous so I got this he also got me this one which is different colors um then I got well my cousin Tati got got me as a present this one which is very pretty also with gold trimmings and navy blue I love this one and I bought one for my other best friend and um, she hasn't seen it yet and I have to send it to her um, it's this one which is very elegant so I got that then um Around the city, uh, we were around the churches because the churches are so beautiful over there. The architecture, the inside is like gold plated and everything. But there's one particular church that um, they sell things done by um, the nuns. They have things for uh, topical things for like for acne, for wrinkles. Um, they have they make their own glycerin soap, oils. Um, medicine to detox liver and everything that's my cat it's everything natural made by them and um i actually got a one to detox my liver i also got one for to lose weight so i got that and i also got which they're so famous for um agua de rosa which is uh, rose water and to let you know what church it is, it's called Monasterio Santa Catalina de Siena. Basically, they're in the city. They're in the middle of the city. So if you guys go to just check it out, it's also a museum. Um, just ask any, any local about the Santa Catalina church and they'll direct you to it. I also got um, oil, chamomile oil. Ah, there you go. Chamomile oil. And they say it is great for muscular pains, 
for the skin. Um, I've tried it like on my knees after walking for a long time. Uh, on my wrist and it does work. Also got um, sweaters. These are sweaters actually made over there. And I got my husband this one, which is very pretty. A collar here. Really nice, really warm for um, the, the cold weather. I also purchased myself uh, a poncho. And um, it's red with buttons here. So basically you put the buttons here. And it's just so pretty, so nice. I love this color red. And it's nice and warm and for like $4 or less. I got this cobalt sweater or like a cardigan. It's really nice. It has like this long here, long extra fabric. Really pretty. And the sleeves, there's lace, which is very pretty. I love this with jeans and a white shirt. And then, which I found and it was the only one, this is this also cost me less than $4. Um, if I can get it out of the hanger. Um, this one. Also very pretty. I love the color. It has these designs, like very tribal designs right here. And it has these leather um, trimming with feathers and these beads on the end. I love it. Um, and like I said, I found it like maybe less than $4. And also in the city, Ecuador is really known for their, for their leather. So I had to get something in leather. And of course, what would it be best? If it's not in shoes. So I got these shoes. Pretty shoes. Handmade over there in Ecuador. And um, these were $25. And they are super cute. I've worn them several times. Super comfortable. Um, and actually, that's it. I, I bought a lot of food over there. <laughs> um, I just... Went everywhere. Um, my aunt took me to the museums. Um, my uncle, my cousins were amazing. My aunt made delicious food. A big thanks to my family. I'm going to say this in Spanish so if they see this video, they know. Gracias a mi familia por tratarme inmensamente bien. La pasé hermosísimo. Gracias por uh, enseñarme a Ecuador, la hermosura de Ecuador. Y pronto espero volverlos a ver. Los quiero y los amo. Um, basically, thank you for, for everything. All my family were great. And um, I hope to see you soon. And I love you. Hey guys, so I hope you enjoyed the haul. Um, the little things that I bought. Great memories and everything. So after this video, I'm going to go ahead and I am going to add uh, several videos of places that I went um family time uh, museums and everything so i'm gonna put like a, a little collection like a collage of stuff that i did and i might divide it in different little videos so it won't be like a huge one video so that's what i'm gonna do i was actually gonna add it in this video but uh, at the end of the day it was just gonna be too long so what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide in between some small takes of videos and um, stay tuned for other videos I'm going to be posting. Most probably I might post more at the same time, post this one and several others. So check the others out, like those videos, share those videos, ask me any questions in the comments below, subscribe. If you haven't and like all the videos, give it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have any suggestions of future videos you want me to share with you, let me know. And I'll be happy to, to accommodate. So 
Have a great day and always get inspired in discovering the world. Bye.